The Syriac Orthodox Church of Antioch, Classical Syriac, Itu Surioitu Trisat Shubho translate. Ito Surioitu Trisat Subho, Arabic, Alknist Al Syrianit Alardixit or Syriac Orthodox Patriarchate of Antioch and All the East, is an Oriental Orthodox Church with Autocephalous Patriarchate established by Severus of Antioch in Antioch in 518, tracing its founding to St. Peter and St. Paul in the 1st century, according to its tradition. The Church uses the Divine Liturgy of St. James, associated with St. James, the brother of Jesus and Patriarch among the Jewish Christians at Jerusalem. Syriac is the official and liturgical language of the Church based on Syriac Christianity. The primate of the Church is the Syriac Orthodox Patriarch of Antioch currently H.H. Ignatius Aphrem II since 2014, seated in Cathedral of St. George, Bab Tuma, Damascus, Syria. History The Church claims apostolic succession through the pre-Chalcedonian Patriarchate of Antioch to the early Christian communities established by St. Peter in Antioch, Roman Empire, in apostolic era, as described in the Acts of the Apostles New Testament, Acts 11 verse 26. Saint Evodius was Bishop of Antioch until 66 AD, and was succeeded by Saint Ignatius of Antioch. In AD 169, Theophilus of Antioch wrote sole surviving work consists of three apologetic tracts to Autolycus. Patriarch Babylas of Antioch was considered the first saint recorded as having had his remains moved or translated. For religious purposes, a practice that was to become extremely common in later centuries, Eustathius of Antioch supported Athanasius of Alexandria who opposed the followers of the condemned doctrine of Arius Arian controversy at the First Council of Nicaea. During the time of Miletius of Antioch the church split due to his deposition for Homoousian leanings which resulted in the Miletian Schism, which saw several groups and several claimants to the See of Antioch. The Patriarchate was forced to move from Antioch in AD 518 due to Emperor Justin I, who enforced a uniform Chalcedonian Christian orthodoxy throughout the empire. In circa 518, the Syriac Orthodox Church continued to recognize Patriarch Severus of Antioch as the legitimate Patriarch despite his deposition by the Byzantine Empire while those who sought communion with Rome accepted the Council of Chalcedon and the formula of Pope Hormisdas, and recognized the new Chalcedonian Patriarch of Antioch Paul the Jew. Patriarch Severus of Antioch was a significant bishop in the organization of the Syriac Orthodox Patriarchate of Antioch, Byzantine Empire, after he was expelled from Antioch in 518. Bishop Jacob Baradius died 578 is credited for ordaining the majority of the Myophysite hierarchy while facing heavy persecution in the 6th century. Around 1665, many St. Thomas Christians of Kerala, India, affirmed allegiance to the Syriac Orthodox Church, establishing the Malankara Syrian Church reuniting with the See of Antioch for the first time since the Schism of the Church of the East from the jurisdiction of Antioch in 484 after the execution of Babawai. In the Fertile Crescent, controversy occurred in 1783 when a few members of its hierarchy entered in full communion with the Catholic Church, establishing the Syriac Catholic Church as part of the Eastern Catholic Churches. Despite this, the Syriac Orthodox Church remains significantly larger in members and clergy than the Syriac Catholic Church. Although originally established in Antioch, due to persecution, first by the Chalcedonian Romans followed by the Muslim Arabs, the church's patriarchate was subsequently seated in Mor Hananyo Monastery, Mardin, Ottoman Empire 1160-1933, where after Homs 1933-1959, and Damascus, Syria, since 1959. A diaspora has also spread from the Levant, Iraq, and Turkey throughout the world, notably in Sweden, Germany, United Kingdom, Netherlands, Austria, France, United States, Canada, Guatemala, Brazil, Australia, and New Zealand. The Church's members are divided in 26 archdioceses, and 11 patriarchal vicariates. Its original area is present-day Syria, Turkey, and Iraq. The Syriac Orthodox Church participates in ecumenical discussions, being a member of the World Council of Churches since 1960, and of the Middle East Council of Churches since 1974. The precise differences in theology that caused the Chalcedonian controversy is said to have arisen only because of differences in terminology and culture and in the various formulae adopted by different theological schools to express the same matter. 
According to a common declaration statement between Patriarch Ignatius Jacob III of the Syriac Orthodox Church of Antioch and Pope Paul VI of the Roman Catholic Church on Wednesday, 27 October 1971 and again in the common declaration statement between Patriarch Ignatius Zakai Iwas of the Syriac Orthodox Church of Antioch and Pope John Paul II of the Roman Catholic Church on Saturday, 23 June 1984. The Church is often referred to as the Jacobite Church after Jacob Baradius, but it rejects this name due to its apostolic origin. The Syriac Orthodox Church is part of Oriental Orthodoxy, a distinct communion of churches claiming to continue the patristic and apostolic Christology before the schism following the Council of Chalcedon in 451. Apostolic succession the Syriac Orthodox Church claims the status as the most ancient Christian church in the world by apostolic succession from the Patriarchate of Antioch. According to St. Luke, "...the disciples were first called Christians in Antioch." New Testament, Acts 11 verse 26. St. Peter and St. Paul are regarded as the co-founders of the Patriarchate of Antioch in AD 37, with St. Peter serving as its first bishop and considered the first Patriarch of and by the Syriac Orthodox Church having been selected by the founder of the Church Jesus Christ. When St. Peter left Antioch, Evodios and Ignatius presided over the Patriarchate of Antioch. Because of the significance attributed to St. Ignatius in the Syriac Orthodox Church, almost all of the Syriac Orthodox Patriarchs since 1293 have applied the name of Ignatius in the title of the Patriarch preceding their own patriarchal name. <laughs> Patriarchate of Antioch Given the antiquity of the bishopric of Antioch and the importance of the Christian community in the city of Antioch, a commercially significant city in the eastern parts of the Roman Empire, the First Council of Nicaea 325 recognized the bishopric as a primacy patriarchate along with the bishoprics of Rome, Alexandria, and Jerusalem, bestowing authority for the "'Church of Antioch and all of the East' on the Patriarch. Even though the Synod of Nicaea was convened by the Roman Emperor Constantine, the authority of the Ecumenical Synod was also accepted by the Church in the Persian Empire, which was politically isolated from the churches in the Roman Empire. Until 482, this Church accepted the spiritual authority of the Patriarch of Antioch. The Church also maintained a smaller non-Chalcedonian Church under a Catholicos, known by the title Mafriana, until the 1860s. This Catholicate was canonically transferred to India in 1964, as Catholicos of India and continues today as Malankara Jacobite Syrian Orthodox Church, an integral part of the Syriac Orthodox Church with the Syriac Orthodox Patriarch as its head. The Christological controversies that followed the Council of Chalcedon in 451 resulted in a long struggle for the Patriarchate between those who accepted and those who rejected the Council. In 518, Patriarch Severus of Antioch was exiled from the city of Antioch and took refuge in Alexandria. Non-Chalcedonians continued to recognize Severus as the legitimate Patriarch even after his exile in 518 until his death in 538. Jacob Baradaeus continued to ordain patriarchs after Severus continuing the non Chalcedonian succession of patriarchs of the Church of Antioch, in opposition to the government backed Patriarchate of Antioch occupied by the pro Chalcedonian partisans, today known as Greek Orthodox Church of Antioch, leading to its being known popularly as the Jacobite Church, while the Chalcedonian entity were known popularly as Melkites, coming from the Syriac word for king, Malka, an implication of the Chalcedonian Church's relationship to the Roman Emperor. On account of many historical upheavals and consequent hardships which the Church had to undergo, the Patriarchate was transferred to different monasteries in Mesopotamia for centuries. In about 1160, its seat was transferred from Antioch to the more Hananyo Monastery Dear Al in southeastern Turkey near Mardin, where it remained until 1933. They re established themselves in Homs, Syria, due to an adverse political situation in Turkey. In 1959, it was then transferred to Damascus, where it currently resides. The Patriarchate is now situated in Bab Tuma, Damascus, capital of Syria, but the Patriarch resides at the Mar Afrem Monastery in Marat Saidnaya, located about 25 km north of Damascus. Ecumenical relations 
Topic. The bishops of Antioch played a prominent role in the first three synods held at Nicaea 325, Constantinople 381, and Ephesus 431, shaping the formulation and early interpretation of Christian doctrines. In terms of Christology, the Oriental Orthodox understanding is that Christ is one nature, the Logos incarnate, of the full humanity and full divinity. Just as humans are of their mothers and fathers and not in their mothers and fathers, so too is the nature of Christ according to Oriental Orthodoxy. The Chalcedonian understanding is that Christ is, in two natures, full humanity and full divinity. This is the doctrinal difference which separated the Oriental Orthodox from the rest of Christendom. By the 20th century the Chalcedonian Schism was not seen with the same relevance, and from several meetings between the authorities of the Catholic Church and the Oriental Orthodoxy, reconciling declarations emerged in the common statement of the Oriental Orthodox Patriarch Ignatius Zaka IIWAs and Pope John Paul II in 1984. The Syriac Orthodox Church is active in ecumenical dialogues. It has been a member church of World Council of Churches since 1960 and Patriarch Ignatius Zaka IIWAs is one of the presidents of World Council of Churches. The Syriac Orthodox Church is also involved in ecumenical dialogues with the Catholic Church and Eastern Orthodox Churches. There are common Christological and pastoral agreements with the Catholic Church. It has also been involved in the Middle East Council of Churches since 1974. Since 1998, the heads of the three Oriental Orthodox Churches in the Eastern Mediterranean i.e. the Syriac Orthodox Church, the Coptic Orthodox Church and the Armenian Apostolic Church meet regularly each year. Worship Prayer Syriac Orthodox clergy and some devout laity follow a regimen of seven prayers a day, in accordance with Psalm chapter 119. According to the Syriac tradition, an ecclesiastical day starts at sunset, evening or ramsho prayer vespers, night prayer or sotoro prayer compline, midnight or lilio prayer matins, morning or safra prayer prime or lauds, 6 a.m., Third hour or Talath show backquote in prayer terse, 9 a.m. Sixth hour or Sheth show backquote in prayer sext, noon. Ninth hour or Tsha backquote show and prayer nun, 3 p.m. Topic. Liturgy. Topic. The liturgical service, which is called Holy Kerbono in Syriac Aramaic and means Eucharist is celebrated on Sundays and special occasions. The Holy Eucharist consists of Gospel reading, Bible readings, prayers, and songs. During the celebration of the Eucharist, priests and deacons put on elaborate vestments unique to the Syriac Orthodox Church. Whether in the Eastern Mediterranean, India, Europe, the Americas or Australia, the same vestments are worn by all clergy. Apart from certain readings, all prayers are sung in the form of chants and melodies. Hundreds of melodies remain preserved in the book known as Beth Gazo. It is the key reference to Syriac Orthodox Church music. Topic. Bible in the Syriac tradition Topic. Syriac Orthodox churches use the Peshitta Syriac, simple, common, as its Bible. The New Testament books of this Bible are estimated to have been translated from Greek to Syriac between the late 1st century to the early 3rd century AD. The Old Testament of the Peshitta was translated from Hebrew, probably in the 2nd century. The New Testament of the Peshitta, which originally excluded certain disputed books, had become the standard by the early 5th century, replacing two early Syriac versions of the Gospels. Clergy. <inaudible> <inaudible> Topic. Topic. Patriarch Topic. The supreme head of the Syriac Orthodox Church is named Patriarch of Antioch, in reference to his titular pretense to one of the five patriarchates of the Pentarchy of early Eastern Christianity. Considered the father of fathers, he must be an ordained bishop. 
Topic: Bishops. Topic: The bishop title comes from episkopos, a word that means the one who oversees. In the Syriac Orthodox Church, a bishop is a spiritual ruler of the church. Bishops too have different ranks. The highest is the patriarch. Next to him is the Catholicos of India, also known as Mafrian, who is the head of the integral Malankara Jacobite Syrian Orthodox Church in India. Then there are metropolitan bishops or archbishops, and under them there are bishops. Historically, in the Malankara Church, the archbishop was called as archdeacon, who was the local chief and or ecclesiastical authority of the St. Thomas Christians in the Malabar region of India. Priests The priest is the seventh rank and is the duly one appointed to administer the sacraments. Unlike in the Catholic Church, Syriac deacons may marry before ordained as priests, however they may not marry after ordained as priests. There is an honorary rank among the priests that is corepiscopos who has the privileges of first among the priests, and are given a chain with cross and specific vestment decorations. Corepiscopos is the highest rank a married man can be elevated to in the Syriac Orthodox Church. Any ranks above the corepiscopos are unmarried. Topic. Deacons Topic. In the Syriac Orthodox tradition, different ranks among the deacons are specifically assigned with particular duties. The six ranks of diaconate are Almoyo faithful, Madiono confessor of faith, Mizamrano singer, Karoyo reader, Afudiako subdeacon, Masamsano full deacon only a full deacon or Masamsano can take the censer during the divine liturgy to assist the priest. However, in Malankara Syriac Orthodox Church, because of the lack of deacons, altar assistants who do not have any rank of deaconhood may assist the priest. The deacons in Malankara Syriac Orthodox Church are allowed to wear a firo, a cap. Historically the Malankara Church were administered by a local chief called Archdeacon Arkadiokan. Topic. Vestments Topic. The clergy of the Syriac Orthodox Church have unique vestments that are quite different from other Christian denominations. The vestments worn by the clergy vary with their order in the priesthood. The deacons, the priests, the bishops, and the patriarch each have different vestments. Bishops usually wear a black or a red robe with a red belt. They do not, however, wear a red robe in the presence of the patriarch, who wears a red robe. Bishops visiting a diocese outside their jurisdiction also wear black robes in deference to the bishop of the diocese, who alone wears red robes. A priest also wears firo, or a cap, which he must wear for all the public prayers. Monks also wear eskimo, a hood. Priests also have ceremonial shoes which are called emson. Without wearing these shoes, a priest cannot distribute Eucharist to the faithful. Then there is a white robe called katino symbolizing purity. Hamniko or stole is worn over this white robe. Then he wears a girdle called zenoro, and zende, meaning sleeves. If the celebrant is a bishop, he wears a masnapto, or turban, different from the turbans worn by Sikh men. A cope called faino is worn over these vestments. Batrashal, or pallium, is worn over the faino by bishops, similar to hamniko worn by priests. An important aspect is that bishops and corepiscopos have handheld crosses while ordinary priests have none. The priest's usual dress is a black robe. However, in India, due to the hot weather, priests usually wear white robes except when during prayers in the church, when they wear a black robe over the white one. Topic. Primacy of St. Peter Topic. The fathers of the Syriac Orthodox Church tried to give a theological interpretation to the primacy of St. Peter. They were fully convinced of the unique office of Peter in the early Christian community. Ephraim, Aphrahat and Maruthas who were supposed to be the best exponents of the early Syriac tradition unequivocally acknowledged the office of Peter. The Syriac Church fathers following the rabbinic tradition call Jesus, Kepha, for they see, rock, in the Old Testament as a messianic symbol. When Christ gave his own name, Kephas, to Simon, he was giving him participation in the person and office of Christ. 
Christ who is the Kepha and Shepherd made Simon the chief shepherd in his place and gave him the very name Kephas and said that on Kephas he would build the church. Afrahat shared the common Syriac tradition. For him Kepha is in fact another name of Jesus, and Simon was given the right to share the name. The person who receives somebody else's name also obtains the rights of the person who bestows the name. Afrahat makes the stone taken from Jordan a type of Peter. He says Jesus, son of Nun, sets up the stones for a witness in Israel. Jesus our Savior called Simon Kepha Sarirto and set him as the faithful witness among nations. Again he says in his commentary on Deuteronomy that Moses brought forth water from rock Kepha for the people and Jesus sent Simon Kepha to carry his teachings among nations. God accepted him and made him the foundation of the church, and called him Kepha. When he speaks about the transfiguration of Jesus he calls him Simon Peter, the foundation of the church. Ephraim also shared the same view. The Armenian version of Aldhelm's de virginitate records that Peter the rock shunned honor who was the head of the apostles. In a Mimro of Ephraim found in Holy Week liturgy points to the importance of Peter, both Afrahat and Ephraim the Syrian represent the authentic tradition of the Syriac Church. The different orders of liturgies used for sanctification of church buildings, marriages, ordinations etc., reveal that the primacy of Peter is a part of living faith of the Syriac Orthodox Church, however, Syriac Orthodox Don. T believe that St. Peter is indicative of the papal primacy as understood by the Roman see, rather, Petrine primacy, according to the ancient Syriac tradition. <laughs> Global presence Demography <laughs> 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 It is estimated that the Church has 500,000 Syriac Aramean adherents in addition to 1.2 million members of the Jacobite Syrian Christian Church in India. Historically, the followers of the Church are mainly ethnic Syriacs, Assyrians, who comprise the indigenous pre-Arab populations of modern Syria, Iraq and southeastern Turkey. Additionally, there is also a large Syriac community among Mayan converts in Guatemala. In addition, there are a few other autocephalous independent Syriac Orthodox churches following the same or similar liturgy and the same West Syriac Rite Christianity including the Malankara Orthodox Syrian Church and Mar Thoma Syrian Church, both based in India and followed by ethnic Indian St. Thomas Christians. According to 2001 estimates, around 260,000 ethnic Syriacs live in the Middle East. A similar number live in Western Europe and North America, most notably in Sweden and Germany 100,000, and the Americas 50,000. In terms of specifics, there are 170,000 Syriac Orthodox members in Syria, 50,000 in Iraq and 15,000 in Turkey. However, the number of Syriacs in Turkey is rising, due to refugees from Syria and Iraq fleeing ISIS, as well as Syriacs from the diaspora who fled the region during the Turkey-PKK conflict which occurred from the late 70s until the late 90s returning and rebuilding their homes. A specific instance of this occurred in Elbejendi, where a German Syriac returned to his village with a few other families and rebuilt the town together with money earned abroad. In addition to those larger populations of Syriacs, 5,000 live in Palestine 500 in Jerusalem and 5,000 Bethlehem, and around 50,000 are estimated to live in Lebanon. In the Assyrian, Syriac diaspora, there are approximately 80,000 members in the United States, 80,000 in Sweden, 100,000 in Germany, 15,000 in the Netherlands, 200,000 members in Brazil, Switzerland, and Austria and a large number living in Central America, which is mainly made up of indigenous Mayan converts in Guatemala, in addition to the one. 5 million adherents of the Malankara Jacobite Syrian Orthodox Church and their own ethnic diaspora. Topic. Official name Topic. Since the Church has never been the officially adopted religion of a modern-day country, a unique name had long been used to distinguish the Church from the polity of Syria in most languages besides English. This includes Arabic the official language of Syria, where the Church has always been known as the Syriani Church, the term Syriani being the same word used to identify the Syriac language in Arabic. Being the lone exception up until the year 2000, English identified the church mainly as the Syrian Orthodox Church, with Syrian 
being derived from the term Syrian Church. Used by English speaking historians to describe the community in ancient Syria prior to the Nestorian Jacobite split in the 5th century, see Christianity in Syria. Syriac speaking Christians have historically referred to themselves as Sarai, Suryaya, literally, Syriac, leading to most members favoring the term Syriac Orthodox. However, some Assyrian nationalists have favored the term Assyrian Orthodox. Arguing it was more accurate because the term Syria is now generally accepted as an Indo-European corruption of Assyria see name of Syria. The name, Syrian, Orthodox Church failed to distinguish the church in English which uses, Syrian, to designate all things generally related to Syria. In the similar way, the term Assyrian Orthodox Church also led to confusion with the Assyrian Church of the East, itself renamed from the Church of the East in 1976. Hence, in 2000, a holy synod ruled that the church should be named after its official liturgical language of Syriac i.e. Syriac Orthodox Church, as it is in most other languages. The official name of the church in Syriac is pronounced Edtu Syrioitu Trisat Subho. This name has not changed, nor has it changed in any language other than English. The church is often referred to as Jacobite after Jacob Baradius, but it rejects this name. Institutions The Church today has two seminaries, and numerous colleges and other institutions. Among those there are several religious institutions which are noteworthy. Patriarch Afrem I. Barsom established St. Afrem's Clerical School in 1934 in Zaleh, Lebanon. In 1946 it was moved to Mosul, Iraq, where it provided the church with a good selection of graduates, the first among them being Patriarch Moore Ignatius Zaka Iwas and many other church leaders. Also the church has an international Christian education center which is a center for religious education, the Antioch Syrian University at Marat Sidnaya, Damascus. In 1990 he established the Order of St. Jacob Baradius for nuns and renovated street. Afrem's clerical building in Atshana, Lebanon for the New Order. Two new seminaries have been instituted in Sweden and in Salzburg, Austria for the study of the Syriac Church, Syriac theology, Syriac history and Syriac language and culture. Topic jurisdiction of the Patriarchate topic The Syriac Orthodox Church of Antioch originally covered the whole region of the Middle East in India. However, in recent centuries, its parishioners started to emigrate to other countries all over the world. Today, the Syriac Orthodox Church has several archdioceses and patriarchal vicariates in many countries covering six continents. Topic Asia Topic Middle East Syria The Patriarch of Antioch and all the East, the supreme head of the Universal Syriac Orthodox Church Ignatius Afram II, Patriarchal Office Director in Damascus Archbishop Mor Timotheus Mata al Khauri. Archbishopric of Jazeera and Euphrates under the spiritual guidance and direction of acting Archbishop Mor Timotheus Mata al Khauri. Archbishopric of Aleppo under the spiritual guidance and direction of Archbishop Mor Gregorios Johanna Ibrahim. De. Archbishopric of Homs and Hama under the spiritual guidance and direction of Archbishop Mor Selwanos Petros al Nema. Patriarchal Vicariate for the Archdiocese of Damascus under the spiritual guidance and direction of Archbishop Mor Timotheus Mata Alkori, Holy Land. Archbishopric of Israel, Palestine and Jordan under the spiritual guidance and direction of Archbishop Mor Severius Melki Murad, Iraq Archbishopric of Baghdad and Basra under the spiritual guidance and direction of Archbishop Mor Severius Jamil Hawa. Archbishopric of Mosul, Kirkuk and Kurdistan under the spiritual guidance and direction of Archbishop Mor Nicodemus Dawood Sheriff. Served previously by the retired Archbishop but currently Patriarch Advisor Mor Gregorius Saliba Shamoon. Archbishopric of St. Matthew's Monastery under the spiritual guidance and direction of Archbishop Mor Timotheus Musa A. Shamani, Lebanon Archbishopric of Mount Lebanon under the spiritual guidance and direction of Archbishop Mor Theophilos George Saliba. Patriarchal Vicariate of Zal under the spiritual guidance and direction of Archbishop Mor Yostinos Boulos Safar. Archbishopric of Beirut and Benevolent Institutions in Lebanon under the spiritual guidance and direction of Archbishop Mor Clemis Daniel Malik Koria. The Patriarchal Institutions in Lebanon under the spiritual guidance and direction of Archbishop Mor Chrysostom's Michael Shimon, Turkey Archbishopric of Istanbul and Ankara under the spiritual guidance and direction of Archbishop Mor Philoxenos Yusuf Seton. 
Patriarchal Vicariate of Mardin under the spiritual guidance and direction of Archbishop Mor Philuxenos Saliba Osman. Patriarchal Vicariate of Tarabdin under the spiritual guidance and direction of Archbishop Mor Timotheus Samuel Actus. Archbishopric of Adayaman under the spiritual guidance and direction of Archbishop Mor Gregorius Melki Urek, UAE Patriarchal Vicariate of UAE and Arab States of the Persian Gulf under the spiritual guidance and direction of Archbishop Mor Bartholomaus Nathaniel, India The Jacobite Syrian Christian Church, one of the various St. Thomas Christian Churches in India, is an integral part of the Syriac Orthodox Church, with the Patriarch of Antioch as its supreme head. The local head of the church in Malankara Kerala is Baselios Thomas I, ordained by Patriarch Ignatius Zaka Iwas in 2002 and accountable to the Patriarch of Antioch. The headquarters of the church in India is at Puthankruz near Ernakulam in the state of Kerala in South India. The Nanaya Syriac Orthodox Church is an archdiocese under the spiritual guidance and direction of Archbishop Mor Severius Kuriakos with the same patriarchate as its supreme head. Simasana Churches and Evangelistic Association of the East EAE, the first missionary association of Syriac Orthodox Church, is under direct control of H.H. Ignatius Afram II, the Indian or Malankara Orthodox Syrian Church, is not affiliated with the Universal Syriac Orthodox Church. Unlike most other patriarchal churches abroad, the language of the Syriac Orthodox Divine Liturgy in India is mostly in Malayalam along with Syriac. This is because almost all Syriac Christians in India hail from the state of Kerala, where Malayalam is the mother tongue of the people. Europe Belgium Patriarchal Vicariate of Belgium, France and Luxembourg under the spiritual guidance and direction of Archbishop Moore George Coriegermany Patriarchal Vicariate of Germany under the spiritual guidance and direction of Archbishop Mor Philoxenus Matthias Neis. Ecumenical Movement in Germany under the spiritual guidance and direction of Archbishop Mor Julius Hanna Aden, Netherlands. Patriarchal Vicariate of the Netherlands under the spiritual guidance and direction of Archbishop Mor Polycarpus Agin Eugene Aden, Spain. Patriarchal Vicariate of Spain under the spiritual guidance and direction of Archbishop Mor Nikolaus Mahdi Abed Allahad, Sweden Archbishopric of Sweden and Scandinavia under the spiritual guidance and direction of Archbishop Mor Julius Abdullahad Gallo Shabo. Patriarchal Vicariate of Sweden under the spiritual guidance and direction of Archbishop Mor Dioscoros Benjamin Atas, Switzerland Patriarchal Vicariate of Switzerland and Austria under the spiritual guidance and direction of Archbishop Mor Dionysus Issa Gerbas, United Kingdom Patriarchal Vicariate of the United Kingdom under the spiritual guidance and direction of Archbishop Mor Athanasius Toma Dewad. Gallery North America United States Patriarchal Vicariate of the Eastern United States under the spiritual guidance and direction of the Patriarch Ignatius Aphrem II and assisted by Archbishop Mor Dionysus Jean Kouak. Patriarchal Vicariate of the Western United States under the spiritual guidance and direction of Archbishop Mor Clemens Eugene Kaplan. Malankara Archdiocese of North America under the spiritual guidance and direction of Archbishop Mor Titus Yeldho Pathakal, Canada. Patriarchal Vicariate of Canada under the spiritual guidance and direction Archbishop Moore Athanasius Elia Bahi. <inaudible> Central America, the Caribbean Islands, and Venezuela <inaudible> Guatemala Archdiocese of Central America, the Caribbean Islands and Venezuela under the spiritual guidance and direction of Archbishop Moore Jacob Eduardo Aguirre Estman. Topic. South America Topic. Argentina Patriarchal Vicariate of Argentina under the spiritual guidance and direction of Archbishop Mor Chrysostomos John Gasali, Brazil Patriarchal Vicariate of Brazil under the spiritual guidance and direction of the Apostolic Nuncio Mor Thethos Bolas Toza Topic. Oceania Australia and New Zealand 
Patriarchal Vicariate of Australia and New Zealand under Archbishop Moore Malatius Malki Malki Gallery See also Topic List of Syriac Orthodox Patriarchs of Antioch Syriac Orthodox Church in the Middle East Dioceses of the Syriac Orthodox Church Monastery of St. Mark, Jerusalem Council of Kaparthutha Topic Syriac Christianity in India Topic Malankara Jacobite Syrian Orthodox Church Catholicos of India Mafrian Malankara Orthodox Syrian Church Indian Orthodox Church Topic Ethnic Communities Topic Syriac Orthodox Christians Middle East Nasranis Guatemalans recent convert activity Topic Other Topic Syriac Catholic Church Syriac Christianity Oriental Orthodoxy Myophysitism Cyril of Alexandria's Christology Church of the East Assyrian Church of the East Ancient Church of the East Assyrian people Assyrian Genocide Tarabdin in Turkey, former Syriac cultural heartland Saffron Monastery, important site in Tarabdin Diasporasoterdalia, Swedish town with many Syriac people and churches The former St. Saviour's Centre for the Deaf in London, now a Syriac Orthodox Cathedral Notes Topic. Topic. References. Topic. Topic. Sources. Topic. Brock, Sebastian P. 1992. Studies in Syriac Christianity: History, Literature, and Theology. Aldershot, Variorum. Brock, Sebastian P. 1996. Syriac Studies, A Classified Bibliography, 1960-1990. Caslic, Parole de l'Orient. Brock, Sebastian P. 1997. A Brief Outline of Syriac Literature. Cotillum, St. Ephraim Ecumenical Research Institute. Brock, Sebastian P. 2006. Fire from Heaven, Studies in Syriac Theology and Liturgy. Aldershot, Ashgate. Mayendorf, John 1989. Imperial Unity and Christian Divisions, The Church 450-680 AD. The Church in History. 2. Crestwood, N.Y., St. Vladimir's Seminary Press. Ostrogorsky, George 1956. History of the Byzantine State. Oxford, Basil Blackwell. European Centre for Law and Justice, 2011, The Persecution of Oriental Christians, What Answer from Europe? R. Janin, Le Right Syrian et les Eglises Syriens, in Revue des Etudes Byzantines, 1919, pp. 321 341. Topic. External links. Topic. Topic. Official websites. Topic. Syriac Orthodox Church Syriac Orthodox Patriarchate Mor Afrem Monastery Topic. Ecumenical relations with the Catholic Church Topic. Pope Benedict XIV, Alatai Sunt on the observance of Oriental Rites, Encyclical, 1755 Addresses of Pope Paul VI and His Holiness Mar Ignatius Jacob III, 1971 Common Declaration of Pope John Paul II and His Holiness Mar Ignatius Zaka IIWAs, 1984 
address of John Paul II on occasion of the visit to the Catholicos of the Malankarese Syrian Orthodox Church, 1986 Address of His Holiness Pope Francis to His Holiness More Ignatius Aphrem II Syriac Orthodox Patriarch of Antioch and All the East, 19 June 2015 Topic. Media Topic. Syriac Religious TV Channel of Syriac Orthodox Patriarchate of Antioch Syriac Liturgy Description and Photos Syriac Music Online Topic. Relating to Syriac Orthodox Church Topic. Margonitho, Syriac Orthodox Resources Topic. Relating to Malankara Jacobite Syrian Orthodox Church Topic. News site of Jacobite Syrian Orthodox Church Malankara Vision, TV of Jacobite Syrian Church Radio Malankara, Radio of Jacobite Syrian Church Online Journal of Syrian Orthodox Church, Syriac Studies and Aramaeans <laughs>